Are you ready? Are you recording? Are you recording? Hey, welcome back to the channel today. Um, we have a wonderful build coming up today. Um, my plan is hopefully to get the Hog Rider hammer hammered out, okay? And it shouldn't be too difficult at all because uh, there's not much to the hammer and so really there's not a lot of tools that are even involved in this build so it should be pretty simple. I'm gonna go through and I'm gonna cut all the stuff. I'll just do a little uh, speed video of that but then I'm gonna go piece it all together and then kind of show you it piece together and then I'm gonna take it all apart, paint it and then put it all back together again. And so that should be my process hopefully. Um, in order to make this build, all you need is a big block of wood. I happen to glue a bunch of pieces of wood together just for this and so I have this block here that's actually pretty huge. I have a little piece of wood and then I have a big piece of wood that's round. Both of them are round and you can get that pretty much any hardware store. Um, some little pieces of wood that are one and a half inches wide. These are quarter inch little sticks of wood and I cut them but I think you can get that at the hardware store as well. That's actually in those dimensions and then of course you're gonna need your nails, your clavos, that actually looks sweet on the Hog Rider hammer, and then a little piece of red ribbon, which I do not have with me right here, but I'm gonna get it. And so let's get to cutting so that we can start to putting together.
All right, now we have everything painted. I painted the head of the hammer. I put like, um, I would say three or four coats on that bad boy. And then I have all the trim pieces painted. There's eight of these bad boys that we are gonna put around the hammer. Um, and I'll show you what I mean on that. And then I also have the bottom part of the hammer painted and the, uh, the rings that are gonna go on the top of the hammer painted. I just used this little stick to paint them so that I could keep painting them and roll them and, and such. Um, the handle for the hammer, I just stained with a provincial stain. So a couple of things on the handle itself. I actually drilled a hole in there and then inside the head of the hammer, I don't know if you're gonna be able to see it, but I drilled a hole in there as well. And so I am going to put, with the wood glue, I'm going to put this little dowel right inside this hole like that so that when we glue it, we'll stick that in there and then we'll stick this whole handle inside the head of the hammer and it will add a lot of strength to it. So we'll glue all that and then glue there and then stick it in there and then it'll stick really well. So. Let's get to doing that first. First thing first is we're gonna put on these, these trim pieces. And then they just, I have it marked. So I'm just gonna nail those things on basically all the way around the hammer and I'm gonna use glue as well and make sure those, those go on real tight. And then I'm gonna nail right where these clavos go so that way you don't see the nails and so we'll just nail right under there with glue and everything and then we'll nail these clavos on in a little second so. Hey, so it looks like we just have one more thing left on this hammer build. It looks so sweet. 
Uh, the colors turned out absolutely perfect. If you compare it with the hammer in game, uh, it is almost exact. I mean, oh my gosh, I am so excited with how this thing turned out. The colors on the actual hammer itself, I gave it kind of a two-tone effect using two different types of spray paint, and so it really pops. Uh, I just wish you guys could see this thing in person. I wish you guys could all come visit me in Idaho and check this thing out. But the last thing that we gotta do, obviously, is add the ribbon, because for some reason, uh, Mr. Hog Rider friend has a ribbon on the end of his hammer. And I, I think it's because, you know, uh, it's, it's got to be a lineage thing, a lineage thing, you know. His family members liked red, and so he always uh, had red growing up. So that's just the way he was. Um, so I'm going to glue this bad boy on. This is going to be hot. I'm going to push that on. Okay. Let's put that there for a second. This is gonna burn, this is gonna hurt. Yep, that hurts. Ow, son of a monkey, that's hot. All right, so that is on there and that is complete. Check this thing out, dude. Ah, oh, turned out so sweet, so sick, okay? Um, Thank you guys so much for dropping by the channel today for this sweet build. I hope you guys liked it as much as I did. I think it turned out amazing. Uh, Hog Rider, obviously one of my favorite characters in all of Clash Royale. I use him all the time. And his hammer, this little bad boy, does a, a ton of damage. And so, in the next video, we're going to test this thing out. So make sure and watch that video as well. And good luck.